What is up, Blue Channel TV? What's happening, man? Make sure you stay true and hit the like button. Don't be a hater all your life. Hit the subscribe right now. Bye -bye. Hey. Bye -bye. Anybody and everybody that's watching this video, y'all, stay positive, keep your head up, no matter what's going on, the universe is perfectly balanced. Um, it's kind of gloomy out here today in Houston, Texas. All last night, I'm talking about all last night, it rained, and it rained heavy, you guys. It poured, it thundered, all of that. And so today, it's kind of looking like gloomy. I am currently on my way to a doctor's appointment. I have to be there at 10.30, but since I am a new patient, I was supposed to be there like 30 minutes earlier, and it is, <clears throat> it is 10.10, so I'm already late, but whatever, they're still gonna have to take me. So you guys, I just wanted to let y'all know why I'm going to the doctor, and I wanted to bring y'all with me because this is like really important, and like I wanted to vlog this just in case anything happens later on in life. Um, and so let me just go ahead and not beat around the bush. I am on my way to go get my birth control taken out, you guys. OMG. After I had baby Houston, I was on birth, I got on birth control. Here I am on my way to go get it taken out less than a year after I got it because I got it six weeks after I had Houston. I want to say I got it right before August and it is barely June. I've been having a lot of problems with it. I still experience hella pain, you guys. To this day, my pain level is like growing, I feel. Because, you know, at first, it's like, okay, I'm recovering from just giving birth. So my body's like going back to trying to get back to normal. I kind of try and ignore it. And then like I push it to the back of my head and I don't think about it. So I just don't even show the pain. I don't even show the discomfort. But it just, it's gotten to the point where I can't even, like, I don't even feel comfortable no more. Sometimes, like, when I'm trying to get up and, like, stand up straight, I can't because it hurts. Like, I'm, like, you know, kind of, like, leaning forward because it just, it feels better. Like, I, I kind of feel like balling up sometimes. I got the Paragard uh, IUD as birth control. And for me, you know, for the most part, you know, it's good. It does the job. I haven't gotten pregnant ever since I got it. I'm just ready to get it out because for one, I am not comfortable. There's days that I'm just like good. I don't even feel it. But there's other days that I so feel it and it hurts so bad. And I'm just like in a bad mood because I'm like, I have a lot to do and I can't even, you know, knock out everything that I have to do because of the simple fact that I'm in pain and it's because of this foreign object in my uterus. So I am on my way to my doctor's appointment. Ah, okay, I gotta go. I don't know where the hell I'm going and I'm kind of embarrassed because there's like people around me. Let me just get to the damn clinic. All right guys, so I made it inside the office and I'm actually so lucky because it is empty in here i'm the only one here so i was like feeling awkward i was like am i gonna be able to vlog like i don't know if i was gonna be able to vlog if there was people in here because i had already felt a little shy pulling at the camera outside walking into the building and then like people were just looking at me like what is this little girl doing you know what i'm saying she got a whole camera and sometimes people are so nosy and they're just like trying to look to see what's going on but I'm here and I am nervous, you guys. I'm just praying to God that everything just goes well and easy and quick. You guys, I don't want to get pregnant. So that's like the big thing that's on my mind right now. And I keep telling Lucky that he just needs to go get snipped. You need to go get a vasectomy, homie. I love you. We got all our kids that we need. We don't need no more, okay? I don't know if I told y'all this before. I'm pretty sure I have. He's always like, if the good Lord wants us to have 10 kids, baby girl, we're going to have 10 kids. But we can't even deal with all the kids that we have now. So it's like, honestly, me personally, I'm good. Because 
for one like kids are cool i love kids like i love kids they're so innocent they're so funny they're so fun to play with and be around and you know i just love loving on kids because that's like our next generation but pregnancy you guys pregnancy is so hard like shout out to all you moms that have done what they've done and gone through what they've gone through girl because pregnancy is just not easy from nausea to being sleepy to having pain to giving birth going into labor like that shit is not easy y'all pray for me all right guys so the process is complete and done it went pretty good it did hurt a little bit but it was just two seconds of the pain and pressure but i wanted to show y'all what the pair guard looks like it is right here so it's basically that thing right there that whole t thing and she did show me the one that i had uh, when she pulled it out i'm gonna get out of here and run home because i know that lucky's probably going crazy with the kids i just told lucky that i am on my way and he was like good we miss you so i miss y'all too baby i am on my way hey guys so we decided to let kingston control it why no idea um yeah, guess we're gonna let King control the day, sadly. Don't let that negative voice inside of your head stop you from reaching your full potential. That's what I be having to tell my son here, Kingston, all the time. Cause he keeps comparing himself to these other super big YouTubers like Mr. Beast. <laughs> And who else? Some well, you could do that too. All you gotta do is turn the camera on, press record. But they got this. No, but no. they do that. No, but no. they have money to give away. And they yeah. do this. But I tell them they had to start from somewhere. They just didn't off the muscle have all these things to give away. So you gotta start from somewhere and keep on pushing and consistency is key. Consistency. Are we going with that? About to go somewhere, I think. Everybody's getting dressed. Or I'll pay, I'll pay, I'll pay, I'll pay. <laughs> I, don't got, I got mixed match socks. I got four people in here knowing somebody sneeze you. I'm just blessed. Bless you. Thank you. Uh oh, here comes Don. Oh, what's up? So, you guys, I came home and Lucky literally like took my shirt off and put this one on. He said, You're gonna change. I have to change. Yeah, I didn't like that shirt you were wearing. Oh, the yellow one? Yeah, I'm gonna throw it. Matter of fact, I'll throw it in the trash. Why? It's I shouldn't wear that to the pool or something. <laughs> Where's my belt at? It's right there. No, it's real belt. Come here, back with y'all when I figure out what's going on. I'm dressed and ready. Y'all wanna see my outfit? I'm looking good. Got this shirt with these pants that match perfectly Adidas. Adidas, and I got these shoes. Got the baby blue. If y'all do not see that. Oh, man, we gotta get this vlog on though, but there's like always in the house chilling like honestly type in the comments What y'all want to see us do like what's entertaining to y'all? What do y'all like to watch on YouTube and whatever y'all like to watch this? Tell us so we can hook, hook you up with that content. You know what I'm saying? Okay They're still doing the hair Can I? Can I? Can I do that? Can I see? Can I have? Can I have some? That's Leah's favorite word, can I? Can I? Can I get some cookies? I'm just waiting for them to be done. It always takes so long for their hair. On your shirt. Dust me off, baby. Dust me off. Oh, you're looking right today. Where y'all wanna go eat? You ready for another baby? I'm gonna take you back. <laughs> we don't care where we eat more Okay, wherever you wanna go, whatever you wanna eat. It's whatever you want. We need to go run to the Western Union real quick, pick up some bread. And uh, Gigi wants to go into the coin store and turn in her coins she has from her piggy bank. And then uh, she gonna buy me lunch. She, <laughs> she goes, I am? No. Said, Mom. Okay, let's go see what these taco trucks is all about. They got, they got barbecue, they got hibachi, they got tacos. Let's go see what they do. That says Latin fusion food. Mmm. 
I am ready for this. This is so dope. Japanese. So I'm guessing these are closed and those are open. Are your pants Molly? Yeah, I need a tight. I told you I needed a belt. I Look, he needs a too. chair like that. about to dig in you guys what are you doing Houston he's loving this Gigi, you look so cute. You know, Father's Day was yesterday, right? So let's play a game. You, King, what's the worst thing you've ever done that your dad doesn't know about? You won't get in trouble. I actually don't know. I pooped outside. <laughs> when? That was a long time ago. Y'all, they locked me outside. And I... Who locked you outside? Yeah. You pooped outside. Oh my God, Gigi, oh. what's the worst guess thing? Guess what? I, I buried it. <laughs> I guess you're paying for the experience here because this is the expensive little food truck I've ever been to in my life. What's the worst thing you've done that your father doesn't know about? A lot of stuff. The, the worst thing that I feel bad about that he that I did to him and that they didn't know. One night, me and my friend, we were probably in junior high, we snuck his car out. And then we were putting the car in neutral and giving it all the gas and putting it in drive and it would take off. You know what I'm saying? And we kept doing that over and over until we broke the transmission. And we were probably like 15 miles from my house and we had to drive it all the way back to the house like on two miles per hour. Like, it wouldn't go. The transmission was done. We finally made it back to the house in the middle of the night and we had to push it up the driveway because it wouldn't even drive up the driveway. So we had to push it up the driveway. And then the next morning when he got up for work and tried to drive his car for work, I was like scared that he was gonna know, but he didn't know. He was just like, dang, man, my transmission went out of my car. And like, he had to pay the mechanic to fix his car. And you know what I'm saying? You know, Grandpa watches these. <laughs> Like he watches these, so like you don't see this. Honestly, then you said butter spaghetti. That's butter. It's the sauce. Analia, I'm finna eat your food. This is my plate. And this is hibachi love. steak. That looks delicious. Leah, you ain't gonna finish all that. I'm gonna have to help you out. Me that. too. Mine, 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 mine. My food. <laughs> How do you make this stuff stop beeping? Oh, I got it. Oh, yes. Whoa. We'll be right back. I never had teriyaki beef. But um, it's not that bad. Just some good. chicken fried rice. Yeah. Give me that white sauce. We need to get a cameraman, guys. I mean, like, we need one, but we're not going to get one because, like, we don't want somebody following us around everywhere, like... You know, you get it, right? What the? Come eat! Come on! Oh! Yes! Yay! Yay! You standing Come up! Come here! Yay! Oh my god! Come here. How long is he gonna do it for? How long is he gonna do it? No, get up, up, up. Yes. Walk, Papa. Come on. Oh. He's going back up, Ma. Yeah. 
Yeah. Guys, guys, he's been standing go, up go, so go, much go, lately. Go, go. He's about to fall into his place. <laughs> I was gonna say I hope y'all enjoyed this enjoyed this vlog. Went to the little what's that place called? Uh, the, we're in the taco stand. No. We went to that little food truck places and then we went mail some merch. Do some other stuff. So yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this little some some. Well, we'll be back with y'all tomorrow. Um, uh, see, we're we gonna see what we do. Y'all stay tuned for the next yeah. video. God. All right. Shout outs to Robert Flores. I want to give a quick shout out to Honey Ford. Thank you for watching. We love y'all and stay tuned. <laughs>